So here's a quick video with some useful tips about using desktop stacks. If you don't know what desktop stacks are they are when you have a messy desktop like this. You can see all these icons here. A lot of us have desktops that look like this, right? Well, you could go to View and choose Use Stacks. And this is what happens. It combines everything into these little stacks on your desktop and they're organized in different ways. So for instance here I have them organized by kind. Documents and Images. If I go to View and Group Stacks By you see I could do it by Date Last Open, Date Added, Modified, Created, or Tags. So when you have a stack like this if you want to see what's in the stack then you click on it and it opens it up. So here are all the documents on the desktop. This isn't a folder. These files are just on the desktop like you saw before. They're just kind of organized this way so all the documents are grouped together. Images are grouped together as well and everything is kept nice and neat. If I go and I turn off Stacks you can see everything is still there the same way it was before. So if you want to access a file you can click on it, go to the file you want, click on the file and you know drag it to where you want or double click it to open the file. But here's a tip that even a lot of people that use Stacks all the time don't know. You don't have to open up a stack to access the files in it. If you move the cursor over a stack like this and then you use two fingers on a trackpad or one finger on an Apple mouse to scroll you can scroll through the files that are there. So you can do this left or right or up or down. So I could do left and right and you can see I can scroll through the files that are in there. Now when I'm in this mode you'll see the actual file name there instead of something like images or documents. And I could actually double click on this now and it will open up that file. I could also have dragged that file as well. So I could go here to this file and now I can drag that file. So you can access the files in the stacks without having to open them up first. You can also change how stacks look by going to View, Show View Options. And here you have the standard options that control all the icons on your desktop. So you can do things like move the label to the right of the icon. You can Show Item Info which will give you the number of items in the stack. You can change the icon size to make it bigger. And you may not want it big when you have a lot of items cluttering up your desktop but with Stacks it makes it easier for you to be able to scroll through the different items and see the previews of them. So if you have a messy desktop you may want to try to tame it using Desktop Stacks. I publish new tutorials every weekday. Hit the Subscribe button so you don't miss out. Then hit the little bell icon to get notifications for each new tutorial.